Alright, welcome back to Las Vegas Market Live. We're standing here in front of the Cari Loja space with Adam Fain, VP of Wholesale, of wholesale. for Cari Loja. Uh, appreciate you inviting us in and giving us a, a few for... moments of your time to chat. Thank you for yeah. having me. Thank you for doing this. Are you kidding? This is fantastic. Hey, uh, appreciate it and you know, Awesome opportunity, you know, my first market, FYI. So, no way. You know, so it is, I know, right? Weird, right? Where you been? I, I don't know. <laughs> they didn't invite me to these things. Now okay. I got the in, so I'm I talked to the right people. You are. Got the in, but no, appreciate your time. Uh, you know, before we dive in and talk about what's going on here at market, you know, tell our, our viewers what's halfway through 23, little over yeah. halfway, right? So how, you know, looking back, how are these first few months of the year? The wheels are coming off. It's crazy, it's bonkers, you know, and it's funny as I hear so much negativity or I hear some that are really thriving out there but I think for us and especially since the partnership with Nationwide we became Nationwide partners in January and I knew that was just going to put us on a trajectory that would just it was uncontrollable and it, it was a hope and a dream but it actually came true so for us and attending you know the primetime events and of course market but really with what we've done in the partnership with Nationwide we can't keep up I'm trying every day that we inventory 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 and yes we, we can fulfill inventory but case in point is it's been bonkers, and we honestly thank Nationwide for that. No, so. And you got a sign to prove it back there, so you see that. Yeah, I have a tattoo <laughs> as well. But you know, trust me, we're quite proud no, of that. That's awesome. Well, let, great, you know, recap of the first half. Look into the back half, you know, end yeah. of the year. What's yeah. kind of the expectation, and, you know, what are you guys doing telling retailers out there? You know, the rest of the year, I would say the demand for our product is, a, is an all time peak. Sustainability. Whether you walk into brand X, Y, or Z, you're going to see sustainability top of mind. So what we are projecting the rest of the year is, yeah, the wheels will be off, right? We've already been off the rails. Um, we're already talking to the biggest retailers literally in the world, meaning that they need sustainability. They need the conversation. They need more than just commoditized products. And so we fulfill that need. More than just creating products and amazing displays, we create the story and the process that truly that's what they're dying to have. Yeah. And so looking at the back half of this year, my training schedule, it's booked. <laughs> our training team is booked. That's our awesome. logistic teams, are, we are booked all the way until December. So Fantastic. that being said, yeah, the second half of the year, I. I I can't wait, well, new, but, I, but I'm nervous. Yeah, right. well, new partnership, right? You mentioned that. What's yeah. been the biggest benefit so far to your brand? To our brand in this partnership, I would say it's the visibility yeah. of what Nationwide can, what you guys do. And I always said this as a sustainability company, you know, we're responsible, all of us manufacturers, for what ends up in our oceans, what ends up in our soils. We're the ones putting the stuff on the shelves. And I knew that with Nationwide, where can I get 5,000, whatever number of retailers' attention in one time? And so the partnership with us and bringing us top of mind to those members and bringing this top of conversation in their stores, it's, I mean, it's just been a godsend. It really has. And awesome. so for us, that partnership, it's beyond a partnership. It's almost family at this point. I need you guys, right? <laughs> Great so, to hear, right? Yeah. Uh, well, so what's been the focus? Let's talk about this week at Market. The focus here uh, in July at World Market Center for you guys. You know, for us, and I would say it's, it's kind of funny. And, in the past, when other brands would do what we were doing, it would make me mad. It, now it's making me so glad, right? Because sustainability is something we should all be doing. And so really, that's what market is, right? That's what we're, that's what we're presenting, obviously, beyond product is the sustainability. And we're seeing that with our competitors, right? If we want to call it that. But I, now I bring them into compadreship, right? Yeah. It, they're not competitors so much anymore. I see us all as on a brand mission collectively. You know, we want to save the planet one way or another, and it sounds cliche, but ultimately it's us at market, and that's the excitement that I'm seeing is that other vendors, other manufacturers are coming to us. Right. How can we do that? What can you do? Where can we collaborate? And so yeah. I'm seeing an evolution it's of cool, manufacturers right? of actually coming together to provide better products and solutions to our partners. If you need a real world example of it, just step outside of these buildings into the 130 degree heat, right? Yeah, I think we got some work to do and it, appreciate everything you're yeah, doing to you know, try to correct that, right? It is a big deal and I think yeah. about it every day, yeah, right? It's, I mean, it's something that's personal to us and just yeah. see it ingrained and seeing it, not just as a marketing ploy from other manufacturers yeah, right. and from retailers, they're seeing a sense of responsibility. Yeah. And you know, I don't want to say, yeah, we're responsible for that. But we want to say, you know, we're pioneers of this. We've been doing this since 2007. Mm -hmm. We're not new to this. We're true to this. And so, for us to see the rest of, you know, these manufacturers and retailers jump on board, I mean, it's it's heartwarming. It's really so cool. they all come on. Hey, let's all go and share in this together. Well, you'll get to continue to share that message in uh, what 12 days? I think something prime like the 13 days. I know. Can Nashville. I can I we'll talk to the members? Please go, guys. Yeah. Members. Yeah. Prime time. 
So market's pretty dang cool. I gotta tell you, you know, it's nothing like prime time, especially this summer market. I would say, you know, overall attendance of this market may be down 25, 30% is what I'm hearing. Great, amazing buyers are here for the largest retailers. But what I found since attending Dallas prime time yep. is that everybody else is at prime time. Yeah. And if you're a member, and I'm just saying that I am not paid, I, I'm <laughs> not indoors, they didn't give me any money. I would say if you're a retailer and you're looking to be competitive, really truly competitive in today's market in a click and mortar world of online and bridging D to C and Omni and all these different philosophies, this primetime event, I tell you, is, it's that bridge to that gap that you've been looking for, and I can tell you what it's done for us. Yeah. I can't imagine what it would do for the retailers out there. And I'm a former retailer myself, a nationwide member, long before I became VP of Wholesale Sales. And I tell you, I never went to a primetime meeting, and I still kick myself every day. <laughs> I'm like, I should have been to every one of them. Case in point, primetime's where it's at. It really is. Market's fantastic, but primetime is the new new. That's, oh, that's, that's, that's truly awesome. where you should be. So, awesome to hear. See you all in Nashville. Yeah, what can, well, what can our retailers expect from, from you guys there, aside from the continuing that message? What are you, so, you bringing to the show? What we're bringing to the show, we're, we're coming guns a blazing, yeah. right? So we don't want to just offer members product. We're going to offer really what you see here. We want to create that shop and shop experience. We have millions of customers that travel the world and visit our stores when they get off of Carnival cruise ships or Princess Cruise Lines in the Bahamas, the Caribbean, Alaska. But when they return home, they want to know where to find Kerala that they fell in love with over when they were on vacation. So ultimately what we want to do is when those consumers come back and Google search where to find Kerala, we want them to be able to find on our website to go to your store and to have that shop and shop experience where they can maybe buy more than just one sheet or one yeah. towel, where they can truly be embraced by our lifestyle products and they can have a place to go and revisit and revisit. So what we're offering our members is really that shop and shop concept. You know, yeah. you can buy product from us and that's great, but that's not what we're looking for. We're looking to really offer partnerships and to really give destinations to our consumers somewhere to go. No, that's so. awesome. And some cool socks too, from what I hear. Oh my gosh. I can't. We talk <laughs> about knocking your socks off. Every member that watches this video, you come find me. Socks are on the house. So I want every member wearing our socks. That's so awesome. In this heat that we are experiencing, yeah. I will tell you, if you're a runner or a walker or an exerciser like me, you cannot walk in cotton socks after wearing these. So in Nashville, we'll be walking around the music center, I'm sure, but you're gonna make sure you remember this. Hit me up for those socks. That's awesome. Adam, I appreciate the time. My Great pleasure, to catch man. up and Super uh, you know, we'll see you in Nashville soon enough. Thank you so much guys. Appreciate it.